Hello friends this is learn and play with losni story time Elmer and the lost teddy David Mukhe Anderson Press The sky was already dark and full of stars when Elmer the patchwork elephant heard the sound of crying It was baby elephant He can't sleep said baby elephant's mother He wants his teddy We took teddy with us on a picnic and somewhere we lost it Never mind said Elmer I will lend him my teddy Tomorrow I will look for the lost one Elmer went away and came back with his teddy Baby elephant smiled and was soon fast asleep with Elmer's teddy beside him. The next day, Elmer set off in search of the lost teddy. He had been gone for when he met his cousin Wilbur. "Hello Wilbur," said Elmer. I am looking for baby elephant's lost teddy. Have you seen it? No, said Wilbur. But if I find it, I will call you. A little later, a voice said, "Hello Elmer, where are you going?" It was Lion. "Baby elephant has lost his teddy, and I am looking for it," said Elmer. Oh dear said Lion Baby Lion would be very upset if he lost his teddy If I find it I will call you Maybe Tiger has seen it As he came near Tiger's place Elmer called out Yo ho Tiger Shh. Elmer Tiger quietly called back The twins saw a sleep Sorry said Elmer Only baby elephant has lost his teddy Have you seen it That's serious said Tiger The twins shouldn't sleep without their teddies If I find it I will call you After that Elmer visited the other animals. All the young ones had their teddies, but none of them had seen baby elephants. They all said the same thing: "If I find it, we will call you." It was getting late into the afternoon, and Teddy was still lost. I hope I find him soon thought Elmer It's nearly night time It was at that moment that he heard a shout Help help and then again Help I'm lost Elmer pushed through some bushes and there was a teddy bear The voice came from the teddy. "Please help me," said the teddy. "I am lost. I want baby elephant." "You can talk?" said Elmer in surprise. "Please take me home," said teddy. "I can't sleep without baby elephant." Elmer still stared. Your mouth isn't moving," he said. Just then, Wilbur appeared from the bushes. "Wilbur," laughed Elmer. "I might have known it was you making Teddy speak." Wilbur chuckled. "I said I would call you." If I found Teddy he said and I did come on let's take 
टेडी होम इट्स गेटिंग डॉ दे सेट ऑफ टूगेदर सिंगिंग एस दे वेंट बेबी एलिफेंट वॉज एक्साइटेड टू सी हिस्स टेडी अगेन and quickly give back elmer's teddy baby elephant's mother couldn't thank elmer and wilbur enough elmer said wilbur weren't you worried that baby elephant would want to keep your teddy Your teddy is very different. It's special. But Wilbur, didn't you know? Said Elmer in surprise. You don't have to be different to be special. All teddies are special, especially your own. That's the end of the story. Hope you like the story. Like, share and subscribe for more videos. Bye-bye.